Good morning, everybody. Today is September 19th, 2021, week number 146 Whoa. in our keto journey. You're taking my job. I took her job. Well, you like to talk, so go ahead and talk. <laughs> Sorry we were late yesterday. Stacy slept in a little bit and uh, rolled over and looked at the clock and said, holy cow, I got to get out of here. And that's what she did. So we yep. didn't get a chance to do one yesterday morning. Yep. So it's Sunday morning and we'll get it in this morning. I set my alarm early and just figured I'd snooze for a minute and longer than that happened. So Yeah. Well, last week I was 335 and I've done nothing different. I'm still doing the IF. I've still uh, did a day of OMAD. Uh, I was going to try and get a day of fasting and I just I couldn't do it. So I did the OMAD. I did the one meal that day. And um, today I was 337, so I'm up to, and I, I don't know, just need to beat myself up. <laughs> <laughs> to beat yourself up. So where you at? Um, last week I weighed in at 150 um, after having the oral surgery. Uh, this weekend I weighed in at 152. Um, my body is still trying to decide what it's doing with this whole menopause thing. Um, it's been almost a week. If I didn't know I couldn't get pregnant, I might think I was pregnant. <laughs> yeah, you just got weirdness going on there. And she, I can attest that you're super, super hot at night. Like sweaty, clammy hot. And it's 67 degrees in the house? Get up and stand in the ceramic tile at the entry door. Hot. Yeah. A or lay in the basement on the leather couch because <laughs> it's cold and it's leather. Yeah. <sighs> I get up and I'm, where did Stacy go? Yeah, I can never find this girl. Let me tell you, this this three or four minutes that we're spending together is the most I'll see you today. And that's kind of the way it is most days. And then she comes home and we still have other projects and things and or other jobs to do. And then, uh, yeah, 5, 10, 20 minutes at night before you fall asleep on the couch and I make you go to bed. And then uh, next day, it's the same. It's like Groundhog Day. Even a day off isn't a day off because there's another job or another project or something. Coming up, we're going to have more than sure we a couple will. of days off together. We'll see. We will. I ain't holding my breath. 30 years of this, I know how this goes. Yeah, so I feel like keto is, uh, you know, I'm trying to trust the keto process. But uh, I don't know. I just, I feel like I'm failing. Everybody's doing so good out there. Just. I feel like I'm stuck in a stalemate and just kind of stagnant. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not even sure. To be honest with you, there's so much going on. Last night, I barely got any sleep. I got about two and a half hours of sleep. I'm exhausted today. Very physically sore. I've been doing a lot of physical activity stuff around here. And um, I just I just don't feel like my body's reacting the way it should be reacting. So... I'm You're doing still dealing with your pain in your back and oh yeah, I got a lot of good stabs in the last four or five days, but I just try not to even think about it and just keep moving forward. So, not much of an update this week, guys. I apologize that uh, we're a day late too. Yep, sorry. So we're we're literally two minutes away from Stacy having to, oh one minute away from Stacy having to leave because she's got to be at work in the next twenty nine minutes, and. Uh, I don't see this week going any different. It's just the way that things are lately. It's just so chaotic and so frazzled and frantic. I really just want life to settle down and slow down. It's it's driving me nuts. Thanking everything above for our health. But, yeah. but I just feel like we're getting run down and pushing so hard that we're not going to have our health. <laughs> you know, two hours of sleep is not good. No type of stuff. We gotta get more sleep, and uh, I just it just never stops. <laughs> never stops. We need to stop the merry-go-round. We'll stop and smell the roses. Oh, Steve Perry has a Christmas album coming out this year. Oh, really? Yeah, you didn't even know that. I didn't because I haven't seen you or talked to you. Yeah. So Steve Perry from Journey, who we really enjoy, and uh, he will have a Christmas album this year. Talking about music, it's serenading us. Yeah, the clock's going <laughs> off. Oh well. All right, guys, it's 10 a.m. We got to get Stacy going for 1030. Yep. And uh, we will talk to y'all soon and see you next week. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.